Hey, what is going on guys and welcome back to another video. Now today is another uh, ranting video, I guess, but informational video as well. Um, this is not from a political standpoint. Uh, this is straight just education and economic facts. Um, and until I'm proven wrong, I'm going to choose to believe in this and I'm going to choose to preach it. Uh, so minimum wage has been uh, rumored to be moving up to $15 an hour. Um, Joe Biden has said that uh, no one who is working 40 hours a week should be making um, under the poverty line for 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 money. Um, however, he doesn't mention that with the minimum wage going up that people are going to be losing jobs. So he just he just mentions the people that are working. So if people aren't working 40 hours a week, then they are going to be in the poverty line and they will also be low, um, basically without a job. So if you if you raise the minimum wage, here's two things that can happen. Number one, you got to remove employees because you won't have enough money to pay these employees. You If you even keep two thirds to five sixths of your employees, um, you're still cutting that, that back. So say you have 10 employees and you cut two of them. You have eight total employees. You're paying $15. That's another two people that are in the poverty line that can't get hired anywhere else if the job is already making under minimum wage and has to go up to 15. Um, so that's how that's going to work. And then basically because of the fact that they won't be able to get another job, they'll be broke, they'll be poor, and there's nothing that people can do for them. Uh, second thing that can happen is... All your stuff will go up, your gas prices, your housing. People think, oh, $15 an hour making a couple bucks more, um, just food and stuff going to go up. No, no, it's renting, housing. Uh, people are going to have to pay more for houses. Uh, renting is going to go up. Uh, the average rent uh, wage or the average rent uh, cost right now is, I think, 1100 1400 in the U.S. That's, that's ridiculous. That's um, about three times more than a mortgage. Um, uh, maybe, maybe two times more, I guess, depending on the house that you have. Um, so, uh, that, that, that would have to happen. So you're cutting people from jobs. You're raising the price on your products. You're raising the price of income. Um, I mean, income and the cost of living. Um, so those, basically you're, you're equaling out the poverty line. So the poverty line goes like this. It's at 725 now. The poverty line goes across like this. You raise it to $15. What do you think this does? This just raises it. You just raise the poverty line and you have people that are down here. You're adding people below the poverty line because they won't be having jobs. The people that are without a job right now won't be able to get a job because these people are getting unemployed because they can't make as much. All these people that don't have a college degree that are trying to get these minimum wage jobs to be able to make a living, they can't do that because these minimum wage jobs are cutting their people and they won't be able to get a job that is already above minimum wage because they need a college degree. How are they going to get a college degree if they can't get a job? They have no financial aid. They can't get a job. Everyone is just going to be coming down. All these how can, um, all these houses are going to be put up um, for closures by the bank because people aren't going to be able to afford their houses. Uh, it's going to result in a bunch of homeless people, um, a bunch of people just it's it's really going to make the economy unstable. Um, you're going to have all these people live in luxury right here and then you're going to basically have almost no middle class. So that is just a little rant. Um, I will probably go more in depth uh, with a chart, with um, pie graphs, with all this kind of stuff, kind of giving you more evidence. But this is just basically a long Tuesday rant. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, please touch that like button. It helps me out a lot. Feel free to subscribe if you are new or if you're old. Either way, feel free to subscribe. I'll probably be doing more rants uh, throughout the week. Probably a Tuesday rant, Thursday rant, maybe. I don't know. Probably multiple rants. Um, there will be another one coming out this week um, based on like football and stuff like that. So uh, again, yeah. So uh we will see y'all next time. Peace out and goodbye.